Hey guys, you're welcome. I'm Dr. Kelvin and this is my channel. I'm a wellness consultant, which means your health is my topmost priority. And I'm always excited to come your way with new content, which is medically relevant to you, enjoying your life and everything that comes with it. And today we are talking about, sorry, kids are watching. <laughs> Ladies, have you wondered why every now and then you struggle to get wet? Stay against it, it's gonna be worth your while. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button so that we can build this community together. All right, so three reasons why you struggle with lubrication every now and then. Number one, you are distracted, which means you are stressed. Now, stress is the most common reason why you struggle with lubrication when the moment is right. Everything is perfect. The man is here. The mood is right. The candles are lit. The music is great, <laughs> but you just can't get the lubrication to get the show on the road. Stress is the number one reason. Could it be work stress? Could it be home stress? Could it be financial stress? Or could it just be that the location is not conducive enough for you, so you are uncomfortable? You know, so any form of distraction can take away from what you're trying to achieve. And that can be the reason why you are struggling with lubrication. And so you need to deal with whatever it is that is causing you distress or causing you stress so that once that thing is out of the way, then you can focus. Of course, the key word again is focus. If you can block all these distractions and just focus on the moment, it helps to get the lubrication going. So that's number one. When you are distracted, you will struggle to achieve lubrication. The second reason why you probably struggle with lubrication is because you are just not that into the partner. <laughs> yes, I mean, this is something that you do with a partner. So obviously, if you are not into that partner, you will struggle with lubrication. And so it pays to get it on with somebody that you are really into. And that will reduce the amount of pressure you're putting on yourself. You know, for all intents and purposes, men are wired differently from women. Women need to feel their partner to get the lubrication going. So if you're not feeling that partner or maybe that partner has offended you and he's here to apologize, <laughs> you will struggle to get the lubrication on. And so for the men, if you are the reason why she's upset, you need to fix that before you get into that zone. And the third reason why you probably are struggling with lubrication is because you actually do have a medical condition. The commonest medical conditions that could result in lubrication issues is actually hormonal imbalances. Your brain is the largest sex organ for all intents and purposes. Everything begins and ends in the brain. It's the brain that's going to send out the various signals for the body to respond to. Now, if the hormones and the triggers that are supposed to get the brain to do what it's supposed to do are not in sync, are not in balance, it is going to affect how the brain communicates to the various organs in the body. And that could result in you not being able to achieve the lubrication you need to have a pleasurable ride. Now, I'm sure you might be wondering what use is this lubrication anyway? If you rub your arm against your arm, you would feel some discomfort. It is not pleasurable at all. And so lubrication is necessary to reduce the friction. Without lubrication, that friction could result in discomfort. It could actually result in some injury tears in the vagina and even on the penis so you make you must make sure that the mood is right and the lubrication is adequate don't be in a hurry especially for the men don't be in a hurry to penetrate and cause your partner distress it is very very important that you wait for the right moment that's why foreplay is very very important we are going to have a full session on foreplay but in this session we are talking about three reasons why lubrication might fail your partner and so if you as a man you want to make sure your partner is okay Make sure that you put her in the right frame of mind, help her deal with her stresses, and then you can have her all to yourself. <laughs> and if you as a woman realize that things are not going the right way, try and make sure that you fix some of these things as much as possible before you get into the, into the action. Of course, there are lubricants that you can employ in this event. Make sure that they are aqueous based lubricants. We will have a session about this one as well. But aqueous based lubricants are preferred because they cause less problems. They have less sensitivity issues than the other forms of lubrication. So stick and stay and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you have a question, leave it in the comment section. Let's connect. Let's engage. Have a fabulous time. Signing out.